Yes, I'm a badass and I can cook. Didn't ask for your opinion. I know me. I'm a badass and I can cook. Yeah, 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 Bad little flex, she wanna know me I stay low-key, all gas, no brakes Baby, let them hoes sleep Body on 10, make your girl OD I get in my way, never out of my lane Feel like you the one and I'm on one So what it's gonna be? Baby, squad up, we finna go deep Is you riding on a team? Got what you need Baby, won't you keep me company? morning my kit cats i hope you can see me in this lighting let's see if we can get a little bit more i if you don't know me my name is kate i am new to youtube so i need your support if you're new to my channel please like and subscribe really really need your support like share comment if you're returning i uh, thank you so much appreciate it this morning i know my last couple of videos have been kind of rushed and I'm, I'm trying to get better no we don't say try here we're getting better we will be better and i'm looking kind of cute this morning y'all i was listening to an influencer on the youtube and she said don't point out negative i'm like you're so right um, but this morning I am on the way to get rent and discuss something with a renter and I need to go by the market and depending on how she pays me I might have to go by the bank and I got a couple of errands to run today so I thought I'd take you with me also I will be cooking later today I think I'm gonna make enchiladas today so I'm gonna show you the recipe for that uh, if you're interested I hope you stay tuned and please again like and subscribe okay I'm going to Kroger's and get a little bit Back in the car, I really need to go by Dollar Tree, get a little box so that I can put some stuff by my chair. A chair in it. Um, maybe I'll try to run before it rains. So I'm gonna take you to Dollar Tree. Lacey, like, can I get today? Yeah, Lacey, can I get a uh, sugar-free vanilla latte with skim milk uh, venti? Hey, a sugar-free vanilla latte venti. Would you like that hot or iced today? Hot. Okay, so venti hot latte made with sugar-free vanilla. And what else for you? Uh, I think that's it. Uh, okay, we'll be six dollars and twenty-two cents. Thank you. That's always the line here, but at least it goes fast. Yeah, we're gonna run the Dollar Tree after Starbucks. I didn't have breakfast, I didn't think about that. Well. I've been a little rush. 
getting things done. Trying to slow down more. A um, friend of mine told me I didn't put enough stuff about. Thank you. Put enough stuff. Have a good day. Thank you, you too. But I didn't put enough stuff. See, that's my dream. I didn't put enough stuff about the condo, which you saw in the last video. I put the condo stuff in there. But my daughter was real funny about. Mom taking pictures of a condo and it's not finished. And it's about 90% finished right now. We got some doors we need to put in. Some artwork need to be put in. Um, a couple of rugs that we want to put down. Um, a dining room table she wants to buy. A little kitchen um, bistro table she wants to buy. So it's stuff like that that hasn't been put in there. But that that's stuff that's going to come over time. And as we buy it, you know, I'll, I'll pop it up on... As we buy it, we'll pop it up on the channel for you. But that's what I like to do. Um, now, my future daughter-in-law wants me to help her put her house together a little bit. Because my son, if it's brown and it's tan, that's what he likes. And I'm like, okay. You have a girl in the house now. You can't just put brown and tan. But we can work with brown and tan and put a little color in there, whatever, you know, suits her. So, I thought about helping her. I really don't want to go in another woman's house and, you know, redo her house. I thought her mom would have done that, but her mom might be feeling the same way. So, uh, I, I might just take one room and work from there. Maybe the front room, the dining room. Do the dining room. And maybe work from there. <sighs> so yeah. That I've been thinking. So now I'm on the way to Dollar Tree. And see if I can find a little wooden box. Mom and Dad's only daughter, do I make you proud? Writing my life in lyrics, do you like the sound? Seeking approval constantly. When it's my truth, I own, I speak it, don't make sense now. Give it a good, yeah. put that on good when it gets hard. I stay on my job like no days off. So Okay, I didn't get that much. I got some steaks that we're going to separate and season up for later. I got two containers of Minimate because they were on sale. The sugar-free. Love it. Some bananas. Some mandarin. Grapes because we love grapes. I have to clean that up. I got me, I need some more goalies. I got NyQuil, NyQuil Severe, only because baby girl is not feeling well. Got me some flowers. And I got some for my mom. And I like to have fresh flowers in the house. They tend to boost your attitude. And I've kind of been out over the last couple of days. So I figured a little bit of flowers couldn't hurt. So I'm gonna put my flowers out. And I'm going to get all of this stuff put away. And little man is at the door because he wants to come in the house. And he's going to get his hair cut. He's going to get his hair cut next week. And 
yeah so let me put all these things away and i'll come right back yes i'm a badass and i can cook didn't ask for your opinion i know me i'm a badass and i can cook yeah i said it i'm a badass and i can cook didn't ask for no negativity didn't ask for nothing else so we're gonna do another recipe this one is a cheesy chicken and bean enchilada again we have an onion, herbal onion. We have tortillas. We have some jasmine rice. We have some Mexican cheese, some black beans. We have a small can of enchilada sauce, a tomato, sour cream, a lime, garlic, <laughs> uh, pepper, <laughs> seasoning, and tomato paste. So I'm going to prep my vegetables, cut them up, and I'll get right back to you. Okay guys, I have prepped everything. I've cut up my onions. I have drained the black beans. Let's see if I can get the camera show. Yeah. Here, you see that I have cut up the cilantro, the peppers, the tomato, the garlic, and the lime. So. Okay, now we're going to put in the garlic. about two to three minutes. Now we're going to add the rice. Again, this is jasmine rice. And we're going to add about two tablespoons of tomato paste. You see if you can coat all of the rice with it. You know, I'm just sitting here. I was like, you know, I said, yeah, I'm a badass and I can cook. And why I say that is, if you're not positive about yourself, how you expect other people to be positive about you? So you know what? When I say this is no place for negativity, this is definitely the channel for no place for negativity. We got this. And if anybody don't like that we got it, then they got the problem. Okay, we make sure everything is coated. Can you see that? All of the rice is coated.
when I say we all about us, we all about us. Everybody got that negative attitude. We had enough of that. So we're going to put one and a quarter cup of water in here. Okay, one and a quarter cup of water. And a teaspoon of salt but I don't want so much salt so I'm going to put a half a teaspoon okay it's boiling now so we are going to lower Cover it and let that cook for about mm, 18 to 20 minutes. Alexa, set timer for 18 minutes. 18 minutes, starting now. Okay, I need to put a teaspoon of Southwest seasoning in there. There you go. We're gonna cover it. Okay, now I'm going to get another pan, put a little oil in it. And get it ready for the chicken. Got the chicken, which I packed dry with a paper towel. Rinse it and pat it dry. It in the bowl and put Mexican seasoning on it. Okay, we got the Mexican seasoning on the chicken. chicken in here and brown it. Now you know me. I don't normally cook rice like that because my thing is you put it in the rice pot it does all the work for you. But since you have to put so much stuff in there and have to brown the onions and Brown the the garlic and uh, okay, I'm gonna have to cook rice on top of the stove. Now we're cooking the chicken. Yeah, I was telling you about the condo that I showed in the last video. A friend of mine telling me I should have said it in all the videos, which I have to tell you, my realtor, Stacy Fontenot, if you're in the Texas area and you're selling a house. That's the girl for you. She is amazing. Amazing, amazing. I'll try to link her information at the bottom. I'm trying to get better with it, y'all. <clears throat> but she is amazing. Her, her team, oh my gosh. Okay. 
This is the chicken. As you know, chicken don't take long to cook, so you know that's right up my alley. that it's brown we're gonna add the onion we're gonna add that big old pepper we had oh, let me do it like this So far, so good, y'all. I think this looks pretty good. Now we're going to add half of the black beans that I did rinse off. And half of the Mexican cheese. I'm going to get a half a cup of water. Let this cook till it thickens up a little bit with the cheese. And make sure your chicken is cooked thoroughly. Next, we're going to take the tortillas, flour tortillas, put them in a damp paper towel and microwave for 30 seconds. Okay, I put the remaining of the Southwest seasoning in here to help thicken it up. That's coming along pretty good. I have microwaved the tortillas already. 
And that's good. The timer on the rice has gone out. And as you see, the rice is good. So we're going to turn that off and keep it covered. And back to the main dish. Now mind you, the oven has been preheating for 475. I think I forgot to tell you that at the start. So go ahead and preheat your oven for 475. Okay, what we do now, we take a tortilla and fill it up. Let me use this spoon. Be careful, because this stuff is hot. Mm-hmm. It's hot. Now, I'm going to take the rest of this, I'm going to put all the juice on it, but the rest of the mixture and put it on top because what? We don't waste anything at all. Okay, that's so far. Then I'm taking the enchilada sauce and pouring it over. Okay, and I'm gonna take and put in the oven 475 for about eight minutes. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, now to make the ponte sauce, the beans, the other half of the black beans, I have the tomatoes and the cilantro. cilantro to uh, sprinkle on top then we're gonna put lime juice of half the lime then I'm gonna cut up the other half of the onion okay onion
है And this gonna cover and wait till it's ready. And the great reveal. We're gonna throw a little cilantro on there. And I'll show you the end process. This is the pickled tagayo to go on top, and the rice, and we're going to cover this until dinner. Thank you.